What's good, what's good YouTube? I've been a minute since just showed a pickup or did a review without seeing it in front of the camera, but a lot of people were wanting to know on these and I actually thought a lot of these were still sitting on a lot of websites, but I found out after looking that it was a little harder to find. I got lucky and found these on City Gear uh, about a month ago and uh, it is the Air Max LeBron 11 Low. It's the black black hyper crimson and hyper cobalt which is the gum bottom lows and they retailed which is what i got them for for 170 i believe that's just the tag that was on city gear if you guys saw the unboxing on this i said that i had took out the original black laces that it came with because i got my watch the throne customs in i just didn't want to take them out because i plan on leaving these in but just for showing you guys an overview, I figured this would be fine. When I saw these initially, it just reminded me of those uh, War Veteran LeBron 9s uh, that DJ Clark Kent had designed. The only difference with those are they had the hits of the orange, a different interior, but it was mainly a black base with the gum bottom. Also from the LeBron 10 gold medals, I have the lace lock in here. Uh, that's about as far as I was going to go with customizing it besides I need to get a gold swoosh done So again, if you guys know anybody who does good work with customs, let me know. I'd love to hear about it So these are the gum bottoms. I have not wore these out yet I was gonna get a sole protector for these. I still might I think they'll actually clean up really well but uh, as far as there's been a couple other releases as far as gum gum bottoms go and this looks really, really good. It's not too dark, it's not too light. More of a wheat, a wheatish color, I guess you can say, not more on the brown side. It is an all black Air Max bubble with the uh, blacked or more smoky bubble that you can see from the outside. When it hits a certain light, it's like more of an iridescent look to it, but for the most part, this is just black as far as the tabs go back here. Lastly, on the inside here, you can see the crazy, which is what they get their hints from, those multicolor lows, not mixing up with the uh, SE lows. This is what I initially thought of when I saw the multicolor. And for those wondering, production dates on here shows February 26, 2014, all the way until May 17th, 2014. And with the on 11 lows, I do go just with my natural or my true to size in a size 10. I'll throw these on feet real quick so you guys can let me know what you think about them. But just wanted to show you guys progression with these and just what they looked like just separately by themselves. I have a few other pickups that I've gotten that I have not done reviews for and a few more on the way. So let me know what you guys want to see in the comments below. Just make sure to leave me a like if you don't mind. And until next time guys, I'll talk to you soon. Peace.